So thanks to one of the comments for the, from this, one of the subscribers. So I loosened all the bolts around and I'm gonna add this um, RTB for the gasket just to be all around the transmission. Uh, so it could be like a perfect seal. That way I won't have any um, transmission uh, fluid leaks. So big thanks to that subscriber for reminding me about that. So that's something I forgot. All right, so we're gonna add uh, some of this on there. And the reason why I opened uh, just a little bit, not the whole thing, because it did take me about three to four hours just to try to install this. So I don't want to go through the hassle of doing that again. But yeah, so I'm just gonna go all around here just to add that um, RTV stuff. So this is a new um, seals or gaskets for the SST transmission onto the mechatronic unit or valve body. So thanks to Map Performance, I was able, um, I got this um, shipped, and here are the the torque screws that you'll need. Um, the size, the sockets will be a T30, and you'll also need a. T size T25 and I'm giving also an explanation on these ports here and here okay so this port right here this is the first shift fork this one right here is the third shift fork and these are this is the guide pin and this is where the screw is going to go but this one right here this is for the second shift fork sixth shift fork and then um, this one right here we have the uh, two cooler, and then this is the return, uh, the cooler return to filter, and this one right here we have from inner uh, filter. And when we go over to this side right here, so this this just a through hole um, pin, but this one up here, this for the reverse shift fork, this the the fifth uh, shift fork, fourth neutral and we have um, these two right here so this uh, the clutch or the c2 clutch and then we have also the c2 clutch the drum assembly and uh, lube and then the c1 um, clutch is going to be here then we move down to here so this is the c2 um, balance and the c1 balance and then this one right here, this will be your uh, um, pump inlet and also your pump outlet right here. And this one right here, this is just a, um, a guide pin. And this will go the same thing to this part of the transmission as well. So when we look over here on this side of the transmission, so this port right here, this will be the first shift fork, third, and then you have your uh, um, second shift fork, then you have your six, and down here, this would be your two cooler, and also the cooler return to filter, and this one will be from inner filter. Okay, so like this one right here, this will be your uh, reverse shift fork, your fifth, uh, shift fork, fourth shift fork, and this will be your neutral. Then you have your C2 clutch, your drum uh, assembly lube, your C1 uh, clutch. This is a C2 um, clutch assembly or clutch uh, C2 uh, balance, uh, C1 balance, and this one right here. This is your pump inlet and then pump outlet right here and if you want to know where I got all this information from this is from the get rag um, assembly and this tells you all these um, where the, all these ports are going to and everything right here that you need to know about your SST transmission so for a torque screws we're gonna put them in as a star shaped pattern as we're tightening so it's gonna be like one two three four I'm going to jump to five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Uh, eleven being down here. 
So that's how we're gonna tighten all these. And also uh, when we're tightening, we're gonna start at um, 44 foot pounds and then go again and do 89 foot pounds. And you can find this information um, right here. And this is on the uh, uh, twin clutch SSC overhaul uh, transaxle. And here's another, uh, so I'll pause right here so I just show you what the pattern will be when you're doing that star shape pattern. Now we're gonna put all these torque screws on there, all 11 of them in that star shape pattern that I just showed you. So now you have these three smaller ones and these three go right here. Here, here, and there's one at the far end, and uh, back here. And for that one, that's gonna be a T25. Reaching to our final build for this SST transmission for the Mitsubishi Evolution MR. So this here is the new um, clutch um, plates and steel plates for the transmission. Thanks to uh, Jack's Transmissions, he sent me this new one. So yeah. And here's the old one right here. So this is the old one. See, there's just a little bit um, crusty. It's not as brand new as the other one, but they are uh, worn on that one. But yeah, uh, thanks to um, Jack's Transmissions for sending me this new one. And as for the clutch dampener, uh, this one I'll have to get sent into um, SSP Performance so they could uh, fix it because it is broken. There is a uh, There's a lot of rattling in there. Um, so yeah, that'll be fixed. But we have some other parts here too that we're gonna be putting into the, for example, the filter, the internal filter. This is the old one. And here's the new one right here. So we're, we're gonna clean this up, replace it. And also we have our cover here. What else? We also have this in this gear, the pin. So now we're gonna put the the cover on this for the mechatronic unit, and here are your 11 torque screws. So we're gonna do this. So the pattern is gonna be right here. So it's gonna be uh, one, two, three, and four. And you're gonna have a five and six. You're gonna have seven down here and then eight across and nine up here. And you're gonna have 10 and 11 up here, ending up right here. Or 11, I'm sorry, right here. 
and that pattern is going to be right here so I'm going to pause it just a little bit so you can see that and for the tightening uh, torque for these it's going to be right here so you have 80 plus and minus 8 or 89 plus and minus 8 inch pounds Tighten this, it's going to be a size um, T30. Okay, so here's the dirty one. It's been on the, for the, on the car for about 110 miles, 1,000 miles, and here's a new one, and it's all uh, cleaned up. Yep. So now it's ready to go on to the to this part right here. So put this right here. And before you put the, oh, let me leave this here. Before you put the, this onto here, um, there is a screw, which I'll get right now. So you do want to put the, the bottom one that goes in here. Um, in this hole first because that's where the your filter is going to go and it's going to be a lot harder to uh, put it on without like with it on so yeah so to tighten that the inch pounds for that one would be 89 uh, inch pounds And you could have used like a flathead on here, holding it while also uh, tightening this. And here's the key for that one. So the size for this one will be a size 32. And that will fit on here. Now I think there is a torque spec for that right here as well. Uh, yeah, there it is. So 11 plus or minus foot pounds, one foot pounds. Leave the video right here, I'll end it. So only thing we need is uh, the, just these two uh, torque screws that I'm waiting for. And also I'm gonna send the clutch dampener that's gonna be on the bottom here. So we're just, I'm just gonna send that to SSP Performance uh, to fix that. And then we're gonna add our, our new uh, um, clutch plates, uh, steel plates. Um, assembly in there so we just need to flip the transmission over to put that tighten it add that one gear that goes on there but yeah that's a uh, for the most part but for the next video yeah that should be the end of this SST transmission build